Howdy there folks, it's Core here with Slash Gear and Android Community showing you an all new Lenovo um, Android 4.0 ice cream sandwich tablet. What this is here is the brand new IdeaTab S2109 um, and uh, this is basically uh, Lenovo's new iPad sized Android tablet. The box was extremely hard to get off but we're going to go ahead and show you a quick little bit about it and tell you about the specs and uh, then get into the rest. So for the unboxing here, not much in the box, throw the tablet aside. And conveniently, Lenovo has provided a nice little uh, case for the tablet. Actually, right in the box. So you get the tablet and uh, the case and everything off of the low price of $329. But we'll quickly go through the box. There's not a lot in here except these huge boxes with little, oops, little accessories. So as we tear it open, the Lenovo IdeaTab S2109 has a micro USB cord and a pretty large charger comes in this one so let's just check it out and the charger it does have a uh, proprietary charger so you're not going to be charging this with a micro usb cord anytime soon but throw the box aside get to the tablet again this is the brand new lenovo idea pad s2109 and uh, it doesn't have a 10 inch uh, display it's got a 9.7 like a lot of uh you know the ipads so it um, doesn't have a high resolution or anything, but it's got Android 4.0 Ice Cream Sandwich, and this is kind of the next uh, step for Lenovo tablets. Again, this is 9.7, but the resolution is uh, 1024 by 768, so it's got that 4.3 uh, ratio. Um, it is an IPS display, so it should look good, even though the resolution isn't extremely high. But uh, as you can see, as we kind of flip it around, it's got a nice aluminum design. It does have four stereo speakers in the back with SRS uh, stereo sound so it should be excellent regarding sound but then as you kind of look I mean it's super thin it's got the 9.7 inch screen so it, it's actually very similar in size to the the iPad 2 um, same with the specs it's got a dual core processor but it runs on Android 4.0 uh, ice cream sandwich so what we have under the hood a kind of measly considering what's been out lately um, dual core Texas Instrument 1.0 gigahertz processor 1 gig of RAM um, it does have 16 gigabytes of internal storage, but uh, they do give it uh, no camera and a small little uh, front-facing camera right there. And that is a uh, 1.3 camera with 720p video recording. And uh, then again, like we said, Android 4.0 ice cream sandwich. And then we have all the usuals with uh, a 10, 10 hours of battery life. But right off the bat, when you look, um, this is not the IdeaPad S2. This is the S2109. The S2 is the uh, transformer-like tablet. But when we go through the side here, we have a little microphone and the power button and a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack. And then up on this top is the volume up and down, which is kind of squishy and uh, not extremely easy to hit. And then over on this side, if you can see that, we have the proprietary charger, a micro USB for charging or for syncing, uh, not charging, and then the micro HDMI out. And right here is a micro SD slot for expanded storage. So you do get that option to add more storage to this ice cream sandwich tablet. And uh, that is essentially it. So not bad. The actual design and weight and an aluminum feel is quite nice for a Lenovo. Um, some of their tablets in the past might not have had the, uh, the best build quality. So it looks like they've definitely stepped it up. The speakers have a great feel. Why all four don't have the uh, SRS surround little metal is odd. But overall it's a great design so far. I'm, I'm kind of liking it. Let me get it booting, clean up this screen a little bit, and you can expect a full review here shortly. So well, let's go ahead and get this booted up. Again, we have a 9.7 inch 1024 by 768 resolution 4.3 aspect ratio display. It is IPS dual core and Android 4.0 ice cream sandwich. So a decent little package available now for $329. Uh, so uh, might not be the cheapest, might not be the most expensive, but it's pretty mid-range as far as specs and pricing go. Lenovo S2109, the box says A, S2109A. And there it is, ice cream sandwich. Looks uh, pretty stock, ice cream sandwich, compared to uh, some of their uh, honeycomb tablets. 
had a few uh, interesting little changes and uh, a new launcher so uh, it looks like Lenovo has gone to a pretty stock system here and that is a very bright and vivid screen uh, you can definitely tell by the resolution off a of first glance but maybe that's because I've been using the A700 with that 1920 by 1200 resolution so there it is the brand new Lenovo S2109 stay tuned for a full review guys thanks for watching